five words would be dis- very difficult to describe Kolkata. One is definitely nostalgia. Second is uh, I love the commonalities between Goa and Kolkata. Uh, fish, seafood loving uh, states, uh, soft spoken uh, language, very uh, soft and sweet to hear. Uh, great uh, artists and uh, I would say personalities, food lovers of course. And uh, just the culture, I think both are evolved cultures. Uh, so this would sum up Goa and Calcutta together. One dish I love, very difficult to put a point on one, but uh, Malai Ching is my favorite. First thing what comes to my mind is the, the Nizam rolls. So they've got a nice dish called the avocado chana chaat, which is nice, refreshing and it sounds very good. Well, I've already recreated something called the prawns who drank the ferry, inspired by the dab. So I cooked my prawns in a 10 minute water, I add the malai to the curry and we make a nice goan curry. But the soul is goan, but the presentation is a nice, uh, involved with Bengal as the core, uh, um, uh, core center. Hey, sir. <laughs> Well, I still have a couple of names uh, in the cloud. Uh, one is uh, the offbeat bone, where I've taken recipes from uh, lost recipes and from aunties and uncles who are, you know, uh, from the golden age, uh, but remarrying them. So I've not zeroed down on the name as yet, but this is what I'm looking at something which is offbeat kind of. Food. Comfort food is for me for a go and it's always his curry, be it a prawn curry or a fish curry or a fish head curry for that matter. It's ultimate lunch comfort food. I can sit with that. Again, seasonality is beautiful. In the summer, you have a different set of ingredients. In winters, you have different tubers and pumpkins and gourds growing. So, every season, even in the rains, you've got uh, leafy vegetables, uh, seeds, uh, some fl- flowering fruits. Uh, so, it's a, it's an amazing uh, combination of seasonality versus ingredients. She's good at what she uh, what she does. Uh, she's from the Northeast. So she does uh, pork, uh, doyong, uh, pork and black sesame. And that's one of my favorite. I like the jado, which is their kind of pulao, made with chicken stock and everything. So I can't do her stuff. And she does it definitely, I mean, does it real well. So, 